Okay, in our last video, we had hooked up our keypad to the uh, MM74C922 uh, 4x4 matrix decoder, which basically takes your columns and your rows, your columns here in yellow and your rows here in blue, and it decodes them out to a BCD format that we can see on our LEDs over here. But one of the problems we notice right off the bat is it doesn't care what's printed on the circuit, on the uh, keys here. It's just going to start counting, you know, row one, column one is zero, then one, then two, then three, then four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen back to 16. So, I mean, that's the one problem that we see already, you know, that our, so we'll probably end up having to program something in the ROM to decode the keys further. So we probably will end up not probably having to use the 74C922, although I did order a new keypad that starts here with 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, well, A, B, C, D, E, F. So, yeah, I might be able to just continue to use that and it also had an extra row that I can use for other things so anyhow sorry to get off topic there but our next logical step is to hook this uh, 74C922 to a uh, seven segment display so we can actually see the numbers coming out so we have this uh, 7447 BCD a seven segment decoder and I'm going to hook the uh, outputs from the uh, 74C922 to the inputs of the 7447 decoder and then have it light up our seven segment display. So let's take a quick look at everything here. There's our uh, 74C922, but down here is our 7447, and you can see there's, you know, the the inputs here. They're kind of messed up, where you have A going to 7, B and C going to 1 and 2, and then D going to 6. Now these three right here in the center, number 3, 4, and 5, we're just going to tie those high. I can't tell you why, that's just how the circuit is drawn. Of course, then we have ground here and uh, our VCC up here. And then we just have the seven segment display output, which is A, B, C, D, E, F, and G, which correspond with the A, B, C, D, E, F, and G up here. So that's all there is to it. It's pretty straightforward, and we should be able to get this to work where our uh, 74C922 is actually displaying decimal numbers on our uh, seven segment display. So let's get that wired up. Okay, first thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and take out all these LEDs. We don't need them in there anymore. And I'm going to go ahead and let's see. Let's go ahead and put power to uh, pin 18. And of course, ground to pin 9. Then I'm going to go ahead and move the uh, inputs here. This is A, and A goes all the way down here to pin 7. And we got B, which goes to pin 1. And C, that goes to pin 2. And then finally, D, which goes down here to pin 6. And like I said, we're going to 
take three, four, and five, and plug them into VCC. There's three, and maybe I'll start at five. So since I'm at this angle, make it a little easier for me. Four. And three. And they're all tied high. Now all we have to do is plug in our seven different inputs onto the seven segment display. So we're going to start with uh, A here, which is at the top right here. And that goes into pin 13. So count 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Oops, I might want to unplug the power here. And then 12 goes to B. And 11 goes to C. And then 10 goes to D. Am I getting that? That doesn't look right. I think so. And then 9 goes to E, which is the last one up here. We've got just two more to go. We got. Let's see. And do, 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 do. fourteen goes to G. Fourteen goes to G. Oops, which is on the outside, not the inside. And then fifteen goes to F. Okay, I think we got it. I'm going to try to pin these wires out of the way so we might be able to see it. Let's go ahead and plug in power and see if we can get this thing working. There we go. We got a zero there. I might need to hold this up so you can see it. A one, a two, a three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now here's where we run into a problem here too. First off, we have the original problem that the one is actually a zero. So it's still counting things uh, from zero and incrementing from there. But once we get to nine here, I mean nine here, the uh, 74, 74, that's as far as it goes, 0 to 9. So if you try to go to 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, you're not going to get anything. So that's a problem with the 74, 74. We kind of want to be able to count all the way up, you know, hexadecimally wise from uh, 0 to F. So that will probably, again, have to be programmed into ROM and uh, go from there. But as you can see, we are able to get our keypad up to a seven segment display by simply using the 7474. And of course, the uh, 4x4 matrix 74C922 to decode the, uh, the keypad here. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching.